Hello everyone, you are most welcome again on my channel. Uh, in previous video, I told you about these things in a sentence where we are to change from direct to indirect speech. So first was reporting verb. This, uh, this segment is called reporting verb and reported speech is here to here uh, in co inverted commas. And we change in reporting verb and second change will be in pronoun, third connectors and tenses and in some special words. So in this video, I will tell you all these charts and I will show you uh, what to learn for changing from direct to indirect speech. So here are the uh, charts you should remember for changing from direct to indirect speech. So first is types of sentence. You should remember simple sentence, interrogative sentence, imperative sentence, exclamatory sentence and optative sentence. In case you don't know uh, what these sentences are, you should study them. But in shortcut, let me tell you, interrogatives are question, uh, you can say question sentence where we ask questions. Imperative sentence are about request and order and exclamatory sentences show some surprise Optative sentences are uh, about asking for wish uh, where we use usually may God bless you and such things. So remember all the connectors, the related connectors, we will remember these. And if you learn all these charts, you will definitely understand uh, direct and indir indirect speech well. So sentence connectors will be used in simple sentence. You will use that. Integrative sentences, there are two connectors are used if and whether you can use either one. You can use if or you can use whether. Next one is imperative sentence and it is uh, we will use to an exclamatory sentence. We will use that. In optative sentence, we will use again that. So learn this by heart. Now next one for you is special words what I showed you earlier uh, that special words today will be changed into that day tomorrow will be changed into the next day yesterday the previous day or the day before tonight that night last the previous uh, whatever there will last month the previous month and last year the previous year you will use like this here will be changed into there this will be changed into that these will be changed into those and now will be changed into then. Now here you have reporting verbs change changes in simple sentences. You will use tell, tells and told and you should uh, learn these by heart and uh, later we will uh, learn how to change the direct and indirect speech and it will become crystal clear to you how to use these things. In interrogative sentence, you will use reporting verb change will be uh, asked and inquired. And in imperative sentences, you will have to use order and required. You know what is reported verb now. If you don't know, watch my previous video. Exclamatory sentences, we will use exclaimed with. And in optative sentences, we will use prayed or wished. You must write down all these charts there. Now, next one is here, present indefinite, the change in tenses, present indefinite will be changed into past indefinite and pa present continuous will be changed into past continuous, past perfect will be changed into per past perfect and past, sorry, present perfect continuous will be changed into past perfect continuous. So, present perfect, past perfect. Now, past indefinite will be changed into past perfect, past continuous will be changed into past perfect continuous, past perfect will be changed into, uh, there will be no change in past perfect and past perfect continuous, there will be no change. Now, remember, if we are changing future, future tenses, so will and shall will be changed into would and should, that's it. Now, let's come to the pronoun chart. There will be uh, pronoun changes. So you must remember all these. Let me tell you, there are first person, second person and third person pronouns. 
and there are subject subjective case objective case and possessive case how you will remember all these you will have to practice it like this i me my mine we us our you you your he him his she her her it it its they them there so practice this uh, these all charts and there will be one uh, shortcut to change and which is called sun upon 1 2 3 this is related to pronoun change it will be made clear in next video because it is not possible to tell you here so we will do now some examples in next video so join that video definitely till then bye bye take care see you in next video